Hey guys, Prince of Mastodon here, and um, the IC, or the, the 1C uh, company uh, sent me this game to try out, it's called Black Hole, and it's basically a uh, 2D uh, side-scroller set in space, and uh, I had to restart this because I noticed that my, my face cam was blocking uh, something pretty important on the screen, so I had to start over. So let's go ahead and show you the controls really quick, so you know how I'm playing this game. There is an option for a gamepad, but I didn't plug mine in, but here's my keyboard. E is to activate, enter a special spacebar to, to jump. The W, S, S, A, D keys are for moving your guy around. You can also use your directional keys as well. And uh, the map feature is tab. Alright, so let's go ahead and get into this game. Now, I'm going to tell you right now, the story mode, like, there's an option to skip the story, which I I kind of recommend. I mean, the acting's really awesome, but the story part takes a really long time. I don't know how long it was, but it took, it felt like 10 minutes or so. But I just sat there listening to dialogue after dialogue. It was cool, well done, like awesome audio and, and acting and scripting. It was pretty funny and stuff, but man, it took a long time. So let's go and start over from a new game. Classic mode. Now, they have a full story mode, which if you like story, definitely do it, but if you don't want to keep listening to dialogue after dialogue, skip it. So we'll try uh, less story. Hopefully it's not as bad. Captain Jetson here, activate recording. Date 6th of June, 2121, Earth time. Recording initiated. Here it is, the universe. We can observe it now every day, thousands of light years away from Earth. We're approaching the last black hole that's endangering the very survival of mankind and planet Earth. Boom! If I may, I would like to mention that you are evidently forgetting what black holes truly are. Allow me to show you this Wikipedia article explaining it. A black hole is a region in space-time from which gravity prevents anything, including light, from escape. Escaping! I know the definition of a black hole, thank you very much. It frightens me. I'm terrified of every single black hole we close. Here's the crew. The Atomic Neutral Particle Collector is active, Captain. Positive. All set. The isotopic field indicator is also active and running, sir. Positive. Negative waves equalizer active. Positive. Ignition regulator running. Positive. Ah! Proton arch debacno radio transmitter connected. Huh. Positive. Well done. We're ready. I'm still missing my coffee, though. Oriel, where's my coffee? Let's make this clear now. When I tell you to make coffee, I assume you'll bring it at once. That is your purpose here. Alright, this is me here. This is my guy. So, my mission here is to bring coffee to the captain. So here's the coffee. Hit the E button. Bring Captain Jetson his coffee! By the way, I'm really sick, so sorry if I sound really muffled. I, I'm not feeling too good. Captain, your coffee is on its way. I wanted to make a video. Thank you, Oriel. Please tell the coffee guy to come to the bridge. Also, tell me the ship's location. The black hole marked 16 is situated at the coordinates F9 GH8 RT1. By the way, if I jump, the coffee will actually spill. So I'm not gonna jump this time. I wanna see if he says something nicer to me. Oh! I spilled it! Oh well. See the coffee stains on the wall right now. He's gonna be upset. Seriously, you're bringing me spilled coffee. Yep. This Sorry, is Captain. ridiculous. What? What was your name again? No. Oh. Get to write my awesome name in here. I'll just go for the shortened form of Alex instead of Prince of Mastodon, which takes forever to type out. All right, listen up, guys. We've done 15 black holes so far. All of them were huge, strong, and covered with a magnetic field. 
Oh no, this speech again. Today, this whole thing ends, and we will return to Earth as heroes! Yoo! Yeah! Ha! Attention, please. This is an emergency. Gravity field disrupted. Black Hole 16 is growing bigger. Within the last minute, the event horizon has approached critical distance. Attention, please. This is an emergency. Propulsion unit damage. Level critical. Getting dizzy here. Oriel, abort mission immediately! Negative, Jensen. I proceed according to the protocols. This is the end. We're dead. We're gonna die in here! Captain Jetson, you engaged the SUCK protocol. You may avoid the mission goals by several means. One, full backup of the aggregate unit. Two, full backup of the ship's systems. Three, manual activation necessary. Status update. Full backup, ready. Backup of ship systems, ready. Manual activation necessary. You heard the damn thing. Manual activation necessary. Find that button! System restart initiated. Locking the core. Loading the operating system to an LPDA. Presumable condition. Breakdown. Memory reconstruction. Positive. Rescue anti spaghettification code to prevent death in a black hole active. Okay. Oh. All I wanted to do was drink my coffee and go to bed. Great combination, sir. Impact in five. Four. Three. Hey, you guys want to hear a joke? I heard this one on the radio. Two. So there's this guy. One. Alright, so the screen is white. It's not a technical malfunction, that's the way it is. Style. So I think we just crashed. It's really bright right now. So it's kind of a nice story dialogue intro. Original concept by the Stransky, Markovich, and Yakol. So we crash. Loading. Oreo. Backup build. Identifier. Artificial intelligence of the ship Endera. Loading regulation protocols. Dig. 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 Get up and come to me. Coming. So that uh, that computer girl is a PDA now. Q. Navigation. Explore the entity. Explore the ruins. So let's Tell explore. Me now. The two of us won't repair the ship. Well, unless you have a screwdriver up your sleeve, then we probably could. Hmm. No, you don't. Just as I thought. Oh no! The pressure chamber. Unusable now. We need to figure out how to clean up this mess. This is what's left of our ship. I wonder if my data core survived. Even though the situation suits me quite well, I would love to know what really happened. I just need to find some mechanical legs, and I will be like an android. You get it? Android! <laughs> So you can go this way, which I didn't know, but the story, well the gameplay actually starts if you go to the right. So let's get out of here. My systems aren't giving me any real coordinates, and that galactic map that flew through the ship's front window isn't much help either. We are everywhere but nowhere at the same time. What a miracle. So here's the map. 
So the things that you've explored already, you can see it. So it's kind of like a fog of war, if you will. That's pretty cool. It's back to the world. Save the coffee. Look, coffee! Holding it in your hands certainly makes you feel better, doesn't it? Oh, you simple people. How I would love to have your problems. She has a cute voice, doesn't she? Alright, let's go ahead and... Start the gameplay. We need to learn how to get along. This place will kill you if you don't start taking control of yourself. Do you know that you can grab a ledge and climb up? That's not me, by the way. It's showing me what I can do. So, now this is me controlling it. So yeah, if, if I hit the wall, I bug I will climb it. See that? Pretty cool. Watch out for the abyss. The more force you put into your jump, the further you'll land. Seems logical, huh? So again, that's not me. That's, it's, it's just uh, like a helpful tool. As an intro, it'll stop doing that after a bit. So now this is me again. So that's like a like a warp thing. It teleports me to another part. So you see that blue thing? Yeah, you want to collect these. Oops. So that's basically what you, what you want to do. Pick those up. Boom! And uh, there's a spectator view. You hit this T key, and then it'll show you how how you perform. See, that's me. That's what I just did. I'm not controlling it now. It's just showing me like how I how I did it and how I took a few attempts to get that thing. There's a little blue thing. Yeah, you have to collect those blue things per I guess per level I think. All right, so let's continue. To the next one. I have so a plan. Let's collect as many Sulfurnium balls as we can and take them to the ship. The nanobots will sort it out. Yeah, so those Sulfurnium balls, you gotta collect those. And... I guess it'll repair the ship or something? Activate. Oh yeah, so that... That could be helpful. I don't know if I want to go there just yet, but let me explore over here first. What is this? Poor Selassie. He was so young. No. Hold on. <gasps> That's just a part of his spacesuit. Good. That, though, does not eliminate the possibility of him being dead. Try to look for more of those balls before I leave this area. There might be more here. This is a black box. One of many. They will help me remember what really happened and why the black hole sucked us in. Well, that's what black holes do, they suck. It's locked. Right, let's let's go back to that warp thing. Oh, wait a minute. Can you get up here? Let's try it. Nope. <laughs> Alright, let's go over here on the strange platform. I made a quick analysis and I found a rather high level of gravity here. This force is emitted by the white glowing platforms. So up above me is a white is one of those uh self burmian balls things. Now this is what you have to do to get it. Not not that. That's not what you do. The chance Whoa. that you wouldn't kill yourself is really negligible. So negligible that if you put a bet on it, you'd be a millionaire. What a shame this isn't a lottery. Oh, there's one right there too. Let's get this one. Let's get this one first. And then this one. Boom! Three out of three, baby. Alright, we'll do one more. But this is what you do. It's, it's pretty fun, actually. It's, it's really addicting. And I, I do like this uh, space um, setting. I'm just really sick. I can't really... It hurts when I talk. I feel like my throat's on fire right now. Alright, so there are... I'm not sure how many... self burning balls are on this one. The 
a leap of faith. Before I go there, let me look over here. Ah. Oh. Where did this take me? Alright, there's three here. Three birdian balls. Let's activate this. Oh, did he do one? There's another gravity thing right there. Would hit that. But before I activate it, I want to get this one right here. Oh. Try again. Boom. Let's see if there's any more over here before I. All right. Hey, let's go back and activate that gravity thing, which will tilt the screen. Falling onto this big platform. You could get the last self burn back there this way. Let's try it. Whee! Whee! Glad you enjoyed that. There we go. Boom! I feel so accomplished, guys. Alright, well, let's just do one more. Score! Activate. I will die? <laughs> awesome. Very comforting. Can we do it? There's four on this one. There's four self burning ends on here. Let's try it. Frankly, you are going to die now. Thanks. If anyone else said that, I would have been really upset, but the fact that she said it, it's kind of cute. Yeah. No! Dang it. Oh man. Alright, let's go back. Let's activate one of these. Oh wait, at least I got that. Oh whoa, whoa, there's like lava down there. Crap, how do I get out of here? I think I will die. I can't get up there. Alright, let's kill myself. See, you died, but it doesn't matter. As you can see, I can save you with an imprint of my memory thanks to the black hole modification. Oh, come I on! I gotta kill myself again. This is gonna take quite a while, guys. I'm trying to figure this out. They're awakening. Try not to rotate the gravity so much. Oh my gosh! The problem is, is how do I get back up there? There is no way back up there. Because these don't want these won't flip. These won't rotate the gravity thing again. See? It's freaking dead. The only way I can get back up there is if I hit that thing down here. But I can't get over there. I have to kill myself. 
This level is way too hard. I don't know who designed this level. It's way too freaking hard. The problem is, you don't know how many times these gravity things are going to rotate when, when you activate them. If I hit my head out there, it's going to turn and I'm dead. But I can't rotate back anymore. So frustrating. I only got three of them. I just gave up on it. There were four of them, but if I if I hit that um, rotation thing, it's gonna rotate. But then I'm stuck, I can't go back there. That, that was really frustrating, guys. Way too frustrating. So I can go back if I want to, but I'm not... I'm not going back up there again. That's a, that level, this level you will die is way too hard. Anyways, it's a fun game, but man, that level you will die is way too hard. Way too hard. But I do like the game overall, but if there's any more levels like that, it's just, it's just frustrating. But it's definitely a very fun game. Um, but yeah, I, I think there's a limit as to how many times... Like, ah, oh, it's just so frustrating. Anyways, hope you enjoyed this look at this game. Uh, Black Hole, thank you I, uh, 1C Company for letting me try this. To the menu. Oh, so tired. Yeah, like I was able to get all four of those things, those uh, burn, whatever they're called. The problem is, I, I couldn't get back to the uh, to where you got to start. You, you know, to exit. So it's you can get all four, but I, I just couldn't figure out the sequence of hitting the uh, the rotation things. Because there's only a, there's a limit as to how many times you can hit those things. I'm like, I know it's hard to explain. Try it yourself, you'll see how frustrating it is. I'm sure someone's going to figure out an easy solution for that level. But figuring it out on yourself is going to be really hard. But watching someone else do it, it's going to be easy. Ah. Really quit. <laughs>